We're in the right place. We're in the right place. Come get some. We're in the right place. Let's go. We're here. We're here. Your mindset is the competition's always there. Even with Forbes, who you know opted out, I knew that the competition was right there. I knew that someone, someone could take that right guard spot, and in my mind, it was my job to keep, or you know, to really, really, really take the next step and be, you know, uh, a stud at right guard. And that that was that was something I took personally this offseason was saying I can do it, right? I know I can do it, and doing it. Like the last two weeks, we come out, we dominate, and we win this. Game. Get after him, boy. Let's go. Three. One, two, three. Get a ton of them, man. Have some fun. Good luck. 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 Is that what you were going for? The luck? Dude, my neck hurts. I mean, if you sit back, like look like this, it's not too bad, but out. Prescott is up in the center, second down, and six and a half to get from the 28-yard line. Here's Prescott back, looking, looking. He gets hit, and there he is, the kid from Arlington, Texas. Miles Garrett gets right in and drills him around the waist and knocks him down. And that also puts him in the lead for sacks in the NFL. He's a human Tico. Let's go. Let's go, Reed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. If we're going to talk about being physical, if we're going to talk about finishing, you know, this is the game to do it, right? This is this is the front to do it against, you know, and this is where I need to put my best foot forward, knowing that there's so much I can improve on, and uh, that's promising. And you know, I'm ready to ready to roll. I like it. I like it a little nasty. Mayfield underneath center, and on first down, a little toss sweep goes to Chubb, and on an end around, they give it to Landry, and he's going to fire down the field into the end zone. Touchdown! Odell Beckham Jr. is good. Good job, big guy. Good job. Good job, big fellas. <laughs> Look at what you got, coach. You know, I'm thankful for the staff that's been put around me and Coach Callahan because he wants me to do well. And he's a guy who I remember one of the first weeks I got out there, um, he challenged me to come out, you know, uh, I think it was like 10 minutes early. So I showed up 15 minutes early, right? And he was like, why didn't you show up 25 minutes early? I was like, you got it, coach. Uh, I'll be out here 25 minutes early. So, you know, that was that's who he is. And that he's a guy who's going to get the most out of his reps and his time, and that's just who he is. Um, you know, I'm appreciative of that because being a young guy, I need those reps. Uh, I need to get as many reps at right guard as I can get to make it natural. You good? <laughs> You know, yes, I put the work in and I'm reaping some of the benefits, but to be able to work um, another day is a blessing, right? That's one thing that every game you go into, you, you, you know, you pray to God, please, you know, keep the people on the field healthy. Nick Chubb sitting down on the turf in the Browns offense, standing around him right now with 59 seconds left to go here in the first quarter and Chubb is being helped up. As Chubb smiles as Kareem Hunt is over by him, and he looks better than it did about a minute ago, doesn't it, Doug? Yes, it does. I know that uh, that, I, that I have a lot to work on, and I know that. I mean, I played left guard through college, uh, so like 45, 43 games or 45 games, whatever it was. And then whenever I got to Buffalo, you know, it was more the same. You know, they kind of were like, hey, how's the fastest we can get him on the field at left guard? So, you know, it, it was definitely an adjustment coming in here. Plus, you know, learning a new scheme, it, it was a lot. I mean, um, it was kind of feeling more um, right guard. So I moved over to right. And, you know, when your entire stagger, your, your entire post foot is your right foot, now your post foot's your left foot. And it, it, it has a lot to do with it. And that, that, that was hard, um, you know, learning a new position, learning, learning a new scheme. And um, even with the success of, you know, that we've had early this year, you know, I know there's so much more to build on. <laughs> Oh, 
Got eighty. Is that <laughs> touchdown, OBJ? His second of the day, right. and the Browns are a kick away from tying the ball game up. <laughs> the kick is up, and the kick is good. Hey, human Tico, let's go, nine five. Prescott back to pass. He got hit by Garrett. That ball's loose on the turf, and the Browns have it. Olivier Vernon's got it. Let's go, boys. Come on. You fall in love uh, with the game, and I fell in love with hitting people. Right? I, I, I was wearing my pads to school. <laughs> it's always a mentality thing. How dominant can you be, and what's your consistency of domination? When you're one on one, the first head coach ever said that, right? If if we have 11 guys winning their one on one, we've won. 180. And he shoulders his way in off the left side. Touchdown, Browns! I love it how probably every single Cowboys fan right now is going, "We're losing to Cleveland," not knowing that we're good, man. <laughs> On a reverse, they're going to give it to Beckham. He's rolling to the right and running. He's up to the 50, to the 45, to the 40, 35, 30. There he goes to the 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown! OBJ, he's got a hat trick! Are you f***ing kidding me? Are you f***ing kidding me? What the f*** are talking about? I know, hey! For the extra point, Parkey kicks it, and it got blocked. It looked like they were offside on the left side. The extra point got blocked, and it's loose on the ground, and the Browns fight for the ball in the end zone, and it's picked up by Steven Carlson. Touchdown! Touchdown! That's two points! That's two. Hold on. It's two, right? Okay, okay. Okay. I'm excited. I'm excited. Just trying to help. I'll shut my mouth now. I'll shut my mouth now. I'm up. I'm shut up. I'm shut up now. I just had to say it. Result of the play was legal recovery in the end zone for two points by Cleveland. Two points. The Browns get two. Even the Browns players on their bench are going, wow. I mean, I mean, come on. I mean, it's just dumb at this point. You know, it's the mentality of 1-0 and each week, right? That, that's all it is. 16 one one game seasons, right? You got 16 one game seasons, and that's uh, that's one thing that coach is trying to hit home, uh, as well as you know the mentality of it's all about the next game. And what's what's what are you doing in the next game? Okay. Yes, sir. You know, so that's uh, that's the mentality. Boy, I'll tell you what, Bill Callahan has done a great job with that offensive line. One more knee taken by Baker Mayfield, and that is it. You're a dog, Nons. And as I told you all afternoon long, we had them all the way as the Browns <laughs> win over the Cowboys to go to 3-1 and one on the year with three wins in a row. All right, all right. Hey, I'm talking about weather in the storm. Down 14-7, we scored 34 on it. Woo! Man, I got some stats for you. Plus three, turnover margin. Let's go. Woo! One dude, look at that rock, One dude had 73 yards rushing, 81 yards receiving, and three touchdowns. Where are you, Odell Beckham? Hey! Hey! We're going to be in tomorrow. We're going to get better after this win. All right, we're going to get better after this win. Quarter mark is 3 and 1. Is that enough? No. 13, break this thing down. Yeah. 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 Yeah